Welcome to pre-math. In this video tutorial, we have got this semicircle with a center O such that two triangles are intersecting each other inside this semicircle as you can see in this figure. And moreover, this angle COD is 82 degrees and now we are going to calculate this angle X. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Before we proceed, let me make it very clear that this diagram may not be 100% true to the scale. So let's go ahead and get started with the solution. And here's our very first step. Let's go ahead and connect these two points B and C. Let's go ahead and connect these two points. And here's our much nicer looking diagram. And now let's recall this well-known fact, the angle at the center, this angle is two times the angle at the circumference. So therefore, in our this given problem, this angle 82 is our angle at the center and this angle C, B, D is our angle at the circumference. So therefore, this angle CBD is going to be the half of this angle COD, which is 82 degrees. So half of this is going to be 41 degrees. So thus our angle CBD turns out to be 41 degrees. And now let's recall Thales' theorem. And here's our Thales theorem. If points A, B, and C are distinct point on a circle where the line AC is a diameter, then the angle ABC is a right angle. As you can see in this diagram, this angle is 90 degrees. And if we apply the same theorem in our given problem, this angle a, C, B is going to be 90 degrees. So thus our angle B, C, A turns out to be 90 degrees. And here's our final step. Let me go ahead and call this point E. And now we are going to focus on this uh, triangle E, B, C. And we know that the angle sum in any triangle is 180 degrees. That means the sum of all these three angles, x, this angle, and this angle must be 180 degrees. So let me just write it down, x plus 41 degrees plus 90 degrees is equal to 180 degrees. So x plus, uh, this is going to give us 131 degrees equal to 180 degrees. And now let's go ahead and subtract 131 degrees from both sides. This is gone. So x turns out to be, when we subtract on the right hand side, that is going to give us 49 degrees and that's our answer. So thus our angle x turns out to be 49 degrees. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.